Hello, 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 and welcome back to the channel. What's the story? You know, it, it feels like forever, even though I know I was only live last Sunday. It just it feels like ages. It feels like ages ago. So hello to everybody. Um, really quickly, someone in the chat that hinted that I was that he saw me drunk. Tor, Tor. First of all, fucking brilliant to actually meet you really was really fucking was i was so excited i was ridiculously excited um but no i was not drunk on the day that you met me i, I was drunk probably two days out of the halloween out, out of the, the thingy holiday i can't talk i can't talk and no um for anyone that's wondering if i can tech you're screwed we're all screwed so no um I, I think the first night of the holiday i was drunk and that was pretty much it and i was definitely drunk that first night but still i no i'm not drunk now johnny how dare you how dare you um i don't drink on stream it's a policy i i don't drink on stream so um i'm tired because i haven't slept in like three days but i'm not i'm not drunk so in a way i'm drunk because I haven't slept in three days. So hence the reason why I've gone live today because I don't have a brain, it's, it's gone. Um, so really quickly before I actually say proper hellos, 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 and maybe get some people in, Rob Parks for $5, thank you so much, Rob, says, because life has been fairly shit lately, here is me sharing the wealth, sharing the money that is not the shit anyway. <laughs> well, I have to say, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry that life has been shit for, various people um I took myself on holiday and got away from the shit and when I came back I was right back in the shit because when I came back uh, I realized that the person who was filling in for me um did fuck all did absolutely fuck all uh so I was left with like over 500 emails to sift through because they had done absolutely fuck all because of a little cold I don't know a head cold I don't know drink before the stream um I probably should it would probably get rid of the nerves but no I, I don't like being on stream while intoxicated I've seen where that leaves me um and and it's not a good path let me just say Collie Wobbles hello hello you're not you're never ever escaping that by the way not ever um but yes, I was not drunk. I was not drunk. Um, a few people in the chat have seen me drunk. They can actually say that now. But yeah, I get giddy when I'm drunk. Like ridiculously giddy. Much like when I have no sleep. Um, so yeah. I feel like I'm drunk, but I'm not. Um, let me see. Let me see who else is in the chat. Clive, I swear to God. I think you just pop in to use the word egress to torture me. Um, I'm not sure. It worries me. It worries me. Because you're so fucking intelligent and you've come in to uh to troll me. It's it it's it's borderline honor, really. So how are we all doing? Oh, 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 oh. I see, um, I see secular rarity. Secular. So secular was on this channel a little, little while ago and he, um, agreed. Sorry. I agreed for him that he should, uh, that he should go get a deep fryer. And guess what guys? He went and got a deep fryer. So we're going to have, um, I'll, I'll throw you the link now in a few minutes, rarity, and you can come on, we can have a chat. I need you guys, after this stream ends, to throw in some ingredients and some ideas for him to cook. European mainly, if you can, let's, yeah. And uh, we'll, we'll get him on a stream trying this shit. And we'll all have a laugh. Because it's all good. Mike Hall, thank you. Mike, it's good to see you. Because I know I stream at weird hours for you. So it's really good that you could make it. Um... For five dollars, love you, Craddy. I love you too. You're awesome. Turkey, turkey, turkey. Oh yeah. When um, 
turkey. <laughs> I swear to God, I'm not drunk. Um, not that God exists. It's all real. Uh, when is Thanksgiving? I can I can never remember when Thanksgiving is. Um, did I get <laughs> right? So yes, yes, I did. It is right here. It's right there, right beside my computer for after the stream. Um, I went to Barman's, as most of you will know. I annoyed the fuck out of Barman uh, as soon as I got in because he didn't have any Jameson. And you know me with my Jameson. Like, I like my Jameson. I particularly like the Black Barrel, but I do. I like my Jemmy. And so I kept giving him shit and I kept giving Barwife shit for not having Jemmy. And they went away and got me Jemmy. And I only drank like a third of the bottle. And it's a big one liter bottle, which I'm kind of ashamed at. I, I only had a little bit of it. But uh, then they gave me the bottle and I was like, how the fuck am I going to get this through security? <laughs> and I was with Ryanair. So you know what Ryanair are like. Um, but yes, I got it back. I threw it into my checked luggage. Um, <laughs> and I got like two thirds of a bottle of Jameson. Thank you, Barman and Barwife. And thank you for putting up with all our shit. Uh, we will get some people in in a few minutes and we'll go through um is skeptic still doing uh with no no he's not doing whiskey wednesdays but he is doing something else um and i'm thankful for that he's not going to be drinking on stream anymore i hope um not that there's anything wrong if you can hold your liquor but it's just it's not working for him in his frame of mind so i'm actually really happy that he's decided he needs to do something else for his own well-being yay allows me the sex and uh, Nimrod for 55 sex says whiskey from the hot tap, Guinness from the cold tap, mother's milk is a mild 50%. <laughs> now there is a super joke <laughs> to make about a number of currency. Yes. Enough said. Enough said. I'm not sure. I'm not sure how to take that one. But uh, I love it. I love it. Wait, what? Chips and bacon. I mean, they have bacon over there. I assume they have rashers. I assume they have rashers. But deep fried black pudding, hmm, that's a good one. Although I, I prefer shallow fried. And yes, I am a little bit behind. So just um, let me catch up real quick. Chips, chips and more chips. Yes, proper chips, proper homemade chips. Cut some potatoes. Oh, by the way, by the way, lads. Said this on flip side. I am very, very insulted. <laughs> I went to Barman's and got some chips. And it was like, it was like he cut the potato out of the chip. I, I don't know. I don't understand it at all. Um, I do have a photo. I'll put, I'll put up a photo of this thing. But he says it's great for, um, for sauces. And I'm like, but sauce sticks to the chip. That's the fucking point. But um, yeah, I don't know. I like, I like shallow fried uh, black pudding. So. I don't know. But deep fried, I suppose, could work. <laughs> she's not drunk. She's drunk. Well, that's the thing. I have not, I've not drank anything other than tea today. And a smoothie. Because I like my smoothies. And like, oh, fucking hell, I am way behind. I am way behind, lads. Um, It's in states is last thursday of november so i'll have to have something with all the americans and um, if you want if you want i'll do something uh for thanksgiving or after thanksgiving i don't know and thank you for frank being frank becoming a member yay thank you christ i am behind what has happened fuck off tusk fuck off <laughs> I get to say that because it's my stream. That is proper whiskey. That is proper whiskey. No, he, he had he had whiskey, but he didn't have the whiskey that I liked. He had like shit whiskey. And and I think Tusk can uh, attest. Um I think Tusk can attest to how bad the whiskey was. Um, didn't you get a pizza at Marmon's? Right, well, <clears throat> Tusk. Tusk was supposed to do a pizza challenge with Barman. 
Anna just kept getting put off and put off. And fair play to Tusk, he went and made his own like little um his little base, like a proper pizza base. Um like yeah. And then Barman backed out, Barman ran away. So I didn't get pizza at Barman's. Etty did. And it was one of those pizzas. It was like a hot pizza challenge. And Nimrod, thank you so much. Always show, show me pictures of his cute kitty. That kitty looks like he has a beard. That's impressive. That is very impressive. Yeah. Um. So the pizza challenge didn't happen. Just something to do for next time. Um, but yeah, I had the garlic pizza bread, but it was wasn't bad. Wasn't bad. The cheese bites were nice. It wasn't the cheese bites. What was it? Um, the macaroni bite things. <laughs> My pizza base was delicious too, and it went. It feels like it went to waste. That's so sad. But um, <laughs> come here, come here. I'm not that bad. Can't be that bad. Um, oh yeah, 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 the macaroni and cheese bites. They were real tasty. They were real nice. So what have I missed? What have I missed, folks? Um, right. Well, while while I'm now caught up with the chat uh no he didn't get any lobster on any pizza thank fuck <laughs> um yeah um so again for anyone that missed sunday stream i do want to thank the weirdos that came down with me um which was tusk etty and tatty we had a fucking brilliant week it was absolutely epic uh tusk 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 we need to talk about that horse, man. We need to talk about the horse. Uh, so get your little booty on onto the stream, I think. I think it's at this time I will uh, send out links. <laughs> See, I, I can tech-ish. Um, but yes. Just got a horse. His little hobbly horse. His little hobbly horse. Which he's very happy with. Uh, you spotted the goat. Uh, someone said in the intro for the intro, it's more like spot the keeler. You can see my hand a few times. Um, <laughs> I have a horse, she has a name. Yes, yes, she does. Now, right, so you guys all know that I'm a person of my word. When I say I'm gonna do something, I do it, <laughs> and we got him. Oh, Plothole is on. Uh, Plothole, are you available to jump on? Um, yeah. Disappeared prior to my arrival. Coincidence? Well, he did have it fucking organized from before we actually went down. It was his anniversary, so um, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure that's why. Um, but yeah, it's very suspicious. Very suspicious. Why can't I find anything? Rarity! Hello. How's it going? How are you? Oh, I'm, I'm great. I'm great. I just uh, got back from the grocery store. I figured I'd go ahead and stock up on 50 pounds of potatoes uh, that I'll need. So I just figured... Go ahead and find a place for them. So I've got potatoes under my bed now. Um, yes. Those next to my sink. Um, well, actually, potatoes. Well, my sink, so. Tus Tusk has um, Tusk has a theory of where potatoes should go, don't you, Tusk? <laughs> yeah, I could probably take some guesses, but if you've got space for shoes, 
you've got space for potatoes. <laughs> you're just, you're literally saying, I thought you were going to say like up somebody's ass or something, but you're just saying literally potatoes can go absolutely anywhere. There's no you can, Yeah, you can keep them in the bath. You can keep them in a drawer under the sink, you know, carry them with true. you. That's Mobile probably potatoes, true. you know, <laughs> your own personal potato. I am. Um, I got a new desk, which I'm sitting at right now. Uh, and it, with you've got desk... a space under the desk for potatoes. <laughs> I was going to say, how many potatoes are underneath it? Oh, no, 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 no. He tried to convince me to use all of the drawers in the desk. <laughs> yeah, perfect. To store potatoes. <laughs> store... <laughs> it's perfect potato oh. storage. It's dry. It's like more or less, you know, stable environment, which potatoes love. You know? It just it just seems like you're living up to the stereotype too much, you know, oh, at I that do. point, I do. <laughs> at that point, it's just like, it's like, okay, come on. We get it. Like we get it, you know? No, but uh, until you've had like a, like Tato crisps or chips as you would call them, then you don't understand just how delicious a potato can be. Well, I'm, yep. I'm, I'm excited. Honestly, uh, crafty, crafty sent me a link to, uh, to where I could buy the exact same uh, one that she has. So yeah. she's so for everybody out there that is concerned about how crafty text, just know that she will be walking me through step by step how to use a deep fryer. So if you guys are concerned about that at all, um, you know, don't be. I think I think it'll be fine. Um, we, know, we know you're American, but I'm pretty sure you can like pour oil into a pot and switch yeah, it on it's, 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 literally, just, it's not difficult. It's actually it's actually very difficult for us americans so it is tough yeah well what here's you the do, thing though what you do when you is make the, oh sorry when you make you, fries you, right well, just a quick one when you make fries it's not you're not obliged to cover them in bacon bits and cheese just so um, you know you can you, have them just as they are i don't think hang on i'm sorry that that broke me for a second. Are you sure? <laughs> Are you positive? Absolutely sure. I had a I had a huge argument with a waitress in Florida about this very thing, where I asked for fries and she brought them over covered in cheese and bacon, and I said no, just fries. And she went, but that's how they come. I went, no. Oh yeah. yeah, yeah. You were At some me. point, you put cheese and bacon on those fries. Now, can you take them away and bring me some that don't have you know accoutrements? And she's, but that's how they come. <laughs> For fuck's sake, just give me the damn things. This is this is why I come hang out with y'all because you open my world to to new experiences. Yeah. I mean, fries without cheese and I, I just I don't know. This is I know it's just it's a, it's a wild, crazy, merry-go-round world we live in. It really is. <laughs> Oh, fucking hell. Uh, no, I was just going to say, all you do is turn it right up and put mm. oil in it, and then you put... No, 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 no sorry, 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 no, no. Put oil in it, then turn it right up. Nah. Okay. Don't turn it up. <laughs> it takes a while for the element to heat up anyway. On. Yeah, no, but you don't turn it up to full and then pour oil on to like a... No, you that's how fire Like happen. immediately, immediately. <laughs> no, because this the, the defa fryer that he has is like fucking... Fireproof. Well, it's not fireproof because it it's an electrical. No, no, it's not. <laughs> yeah. No matter how smart you think you are, fire's yeah. one step ahead of you. I, I think I could definitely <laughs> figure out a way to catch it on fire. Yeah. I mean, if if my intentions are right, you know. Well, that's, I, I just love. Like, I, I just any, love um, any machines. A smoke machine with enough application. Tor Tor quote in some ways, G there. Just, oh, just okay, pointing Tom. that out. <laughs> You ruins it! You ruins it! Stupid fat hobbit! Sorry. Um, I love that movie. I know Tony hates it, but like, I love it. Yeah, but, you know, fuck Tony. <laughs> Tony just hates literature, it's fine. Um, oh, that's his live, isn't it? It is, it oh, is. <laughs> Hello, everybody. I didn't realise we were live for a moment there. For some reason, you, I thought you've you had You've been watching it for, like, the last know, 20 minutes some... before you come in. I know, but for some reason, I thought you had two going at the same time i think my brain's slightly bent out of shape you're a fucking gobshy i know that so tusk yeah tell the people <laughs> who weren't here on on sunday about your horse well <laughs> now I, i'm guessing most people know the backstory that keela promised me a horse and then tried to backtrack or back she tried to back trot on it. 
and <laughs> well, having none of it. You know, and on people in the, the chats were backing me up. You know, the only person that was backing you up <laughs> was Clive. Clive Wells, I know. Thank and you, Clive. And that's just because he likes to torture me. I know. No, it's not not just that. It's because you know he likes me too. No. no yeah. No. Well, anyway. Anyway. So anyway. after she tried to backthrow out of the the agreement, uh, it became a thing along with. It's not one legged horse, Collie Wobbles. Thank you. It is two wheeled. For the, at the moment, that's that's going to change. <laughs> right. So yeah. So halfway through uh, our holiday. Uh, Kayla says, oh, let's go for a walk. And I was like, okay, because she'd stated quite clearly at the beginning of the holiday that if anybody wanted to go for a walk over the hills, they could fuck right off. So <laughs> I just assumed we were going to the pub, which suits me fine. But then I thought, the pub isn't even open. What a complete waste of time. We're going to go and sit outside the pub like a bunch of desperate alcoholics waiting for it to open. You know, again, I've got no problem with that. I just wanted to know what the deal was. So we get there and she keeps going like going do 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 doing this countdown thing. <laughs> and I was like, okay, this better be something good because you know, the pump's not even open. And then a van shows up, a delivery van, and out comes a long box. And as soon as I saw the box, I knew what it was. It was going to be my horse, or to give her her full name, Lady Fionn Mountjoy the First. <laughs> <laughs> so oh, so Kayla and Tati are there laughing going ha ha like you got trolled you know you're, you've come all the way out here for like a toy horse but I love her she's, she's actually she, she sleeps next to I actually brought her into the bed the first night we came home uh, <laughs> oh, she sorry. sleeps I keep her next to my bed and give her, pet her nose and everything you know. oh, and so I got on her and she's very, very small at the moment. She's just a pony. She's got a lot of growing to do. So I got on it, and straight away, I just started galloping around. No no, Clive, her name is not Gluey. <laughs> <laughs> and I just galloping her around the car park. And then I discovered that on her ear, she has a little button that makes galloping sounds and neighs. And... I absolutely love it. So we took her around. It's a big, huge, big caravan park. It's like four acres or something. It's really big. And we took her across the horse, eh, the horse, the bridge over the river to see the cows. But, you know, she started getting antsy, so I brought her back. We did some, like, jumping over the fences and hedges and things. And, you know, she had a little drink out of the fish pond and everything. It was what do you feed her? Great. Oh, what she you... just... Oh, oh, at quick, home. Quick, 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 well, quick, well, quick. You, you have to wait for that, you see. Ah. <laughs> so, wait for I it. Ga I galloped her around, to be fair, like a prick. Yeah, you know, for... <laughs> yeah but on video. <laughs> yeah, but on video. <laughs> for about, I don't know, half an hour maybe. And then Eddie showed up. So I started galloping her around again. And then Barman and his wife burst opened the pub and they're standing outside smoking a cigarette looking at me with utter disgust you know like you're a grown man you know what the fuck are you oh no doing? they were pissing themselves they were, they, were themselves. they were laughing but i think they were laughing because it was such a tragic scene <laughs> there wasn't much else to do <laughs> so um so i got her home you know gave her a brush down and everything uh wiped her down because she was getting quite uh sweaty you know she first day out galloping around all that way you know so I took her into the pub that night and I asked the barman if they had a hitching post I could leave her outside. But he said, no, it's fine to bring her in, you know. And there was a little dog in the place, you know, and I introduced like it, it. But the dog didn't like it at all. I don't think it liked the, the clipping of her hoofs. I think that's what it was, that kind of clip-clop sound when you press the ear. So I kept on it, uh, bar wife. I said, well, could that any chance I can get some water and some fodder, you know? She, she, you know, and she just told me to fuck off, really. Yeah. But I now, kept th this on comes, it. Uh, this comes on, on this comes after days of insulting the woman. I wasn't insulting her, her at all. Just now, to wind her up. Well, she she thought I'd called her a hobbit in a previous live stream of the Barmans, <laughs> right? But what happened there was her feet were the only part of her in shot. Right, so no one knew um, 
how big she was or anything. There's no sense of scale. Is she a giant with tiny feet? Or is she like a hobbit with giant feet? And nobody knew. And I said, yeah, Barman, is that a hobbit or like a human? And that's what he turned around and said to her. He said, he just called you a hobbit. <laughs> no, he fucking didn't. Sounded to me like you were just asking questions. But... Yeah. I said, you know, but people just assumed, because it sounds like the sort of thing I would say. Yeah. Yes, so, yes, it does. Just, yeah, so oh, fair enough. So when I got there, she's like, you're that prick that called me a hobbit. <laughs> no, I'm not. But she, so we were chatting, you know, I was just winding her up and everything, and I kept on and on at her until eventually she gave in and brought out a little bowl of water and some salad leaves to feed the horse. <laughs> <laughs> we have video of that too we've got video of her doing that too yeah. <sighs> so as I left I said thank you very much and never forget that I made you do that because <laughs> I'm going to hold that over you for the rest of your life Yep. or mine whichever ends first, probably mine oh, so but, yeah go on yeah. oh no you were going to say something no no go ahead, go ahead. so I galloped the horse around for a little bit more <laughs> You know, it was great fun. It was her first ever night ride, which she was a little bit nervous about, but you know, it was good. So we got home and can I just she was quite happy. She was quite nervous because you know it's all strangers around her. You know, our, our whole experience of life up until that point was the inside of a cardboard box. So on the way back, <laughs> I wound the window down in the car and put her head out so she could see the fields and things. And we got we got some odd looks. <laughs> <laughs> as we drove along the road and as we got onto the motorway people would like pull up beside us and they'd go oh that's a little girl with her horse and then they'd see me staring out at them you know and the Do horse it... would follow them around and shake its head and like disapproval as they sped okay. past us I'm surprised it didn't actually cause an accident, to be honest. Yes, so am I. <laughs> um, just second best Bob asked to show the video uh, the video will be out very soon um, <laughs> Tati is editing it at the moment so that there's no faces shown um, we, because we don't want to be doxing anyone and, and making yeah. people feel uncomfortable and that's a big, big um, ha thing Had I known I was I was going to collect my horse I would Ooh. have um, taken Dulcima with me but I didn't <laughs> so what we've had to do is take a picture of Dulcima and superimpose her head using some and it, it doesn't, and it doesn't help thing. It doesn't help that he's galloping around the place. <laughs> I wasn't galloping. Lady oh, Fee on Mountjoy the First was galloping. I was merely steering her and guiding her as gently as I could. She doesn't seem to mind the bit. I've asked it if she wants me to take it out, but she's quite happy to keep it in. Oh, I think it's a comfort yeah. for her. It's literally the best story I've heard all week. I just have go. to say this is this is this sounds like this sounds like the the conclusion of somebody, you know, really, really wanting something that that means a lot to them and, and just finally being able to achieve that. So really? sounds like I a beautiful it, well, horse. Well, speaking of I that, think it sounds of... like more like the conclusion of somebody <laughs> slipping into like a complete mental <laughs> breakdown. But you, you, you know. <laughs> would you like to but speaking that? of that? But, but hang on. Speaking of that, before you <sighs> before you do that. Um, speaking of getting things that you've waited months and months and months and months for, uh, there is an ongoing um, in joke on on my channel. Um, we have any um, any of my members that are in today. Uh, if you want to share the no dragons for Tusk, um, why, why please do, please do, because no, it's fun. No, it's um, not fun. <laughs> so a huge, huge thank you to Mystique who um, who came down to visit and did the best troll i have ever seen in real life yeah not, whistling innocently oh yeah we're gonna tell this story again not we're funny. gonna tell this story again it's fucking hysterical no no see spectacular hairpiece right doesn't hasn't heard this right not yet and you know we've spoken a couple of times and he's like oh that, that tusk seems like a kind of awesome guy i'd be quite happy to give him a dragon what you wouldn't do right is drive around 300 miles, right? <laughs> Tina is amazing. And go, oh, hello, Tusk. Uh, I've got something for you. And hands me like a little uh, like a little paper bag that you'd get from a bakery. And I'm thinking, oh, lovely. You know, she's brought me down like a nice cake or a pie or something she's made herself. 
Then as I'm about to take it, she cruelly snatches it away from me and says, no, you can't have this, and hands it to my partner, who opens the bag and finds a fucking dragon in it. <laughs> and then she goes, oh, I'm so seen... sorry, I'm so sorry. His face, my His face. face was I, amazing. I was, I was gutted. Bearing in mind that I was probably quite hungover from the night before as well. And then she says, oh, sorry, I shouldn't have done that. Brings out another bag and gives it to Keela. And then gives a little dragon fucking fridge magnet to Tati and leaves me standing there dragonless. For about five minutes, he was just standing there like, what, what the hell is happening here? <laughs> that was just mean. Now, after that, I decided for about an hour that everything and everybody was called Eric. And I just kept saying Eric, Eric over and over again, making up, you know, bands like <laughs> Eric and the Dominoes and things like that. And I don't know why. I don't even remember why Eric became a thing. But yeah, I got trolled in real life and I didn't get my dragon. What I got was, I don't want to sound, um, what's what I'm looking for? Ungrateful. Yeah, that's what Kayla got. It's adorable. I got a fridge magnet. Mm. Yep. Listen, but listen, I wanted listen. to show people I am so happy. I'm so happy with my dragon. Thank you so much, Tina. <laughs> Right. Sock full of fairies. You listening? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Sock full of fairies. A couple of responses whenever you're done, if, if that's all right. Just some questions. But... <laughs> is, that, is that your horse? <laughs> Isn't that brilliant? That's so great. <laughs> that really does make me so happy. Uh, I, I was charging that. around the campsite. <laughs> oh, man. Bearing in mind, right, that I'm absolutely covered in tattoos and piercings and there's a the fucking motorhead t-shirt on <laughs> you know I mean? and I'm charging around this campsite it was glorious, it was fucking spectacular it so, was a thing of absolute fucking beauty and good uh, afternoon testicular hey, gravy hey. man, how's it going? <laughs> it's good, how are you daddy? oh I'm doing hey. no see bad mate, no see bad so sock full of fairies you said you had a question or two? Yeah, it's I, I just I just want to make sure that I was I was hearing you right. It sounded like when you started telling that story about how you didn't get a dragon and the disappointment in your life continued, but it sounded like you said at some point I said that you were a cool guy. I just wanted to clarify that real quick cuz I, oh, yeah, I, I that never happened. Yeah, never I was happened. just I didn't think I remembered saying that, but I could have. That that it's never happened. Yeah. happened. Yeah. Nope. Okay. Because nope. it's because you know, spatula hairpiece is wondering why you're all taunting me and being mean to me and, t and trolling me and but yeah. like, why, why why are you doing that? He's a yeah. lovely guy. Never well, I was never I was it. I mean I I'll, I'll, I'll grant I was confused by it at first, but I don't think that that necessitates that you're a you're a cool guy. I think I was just, just I think just it was let, just, just let can you not just let me have that. No, nope. you nope, you're not go. allowed to have that one. Um, Trot Move says it sounds more like a steam train. It sounds like a train in the night. Like a train in the... I can get this. Hang on. Nah. <laughs> Which brings us on to the video, because the video is going to have Tusk doing... Um... No, it's not. Is it not? Is that another video then? It's going to have Dulcimer. Ah, uh, Dulcimer is singing. Okay. Yeah, Dulcimer just said she wanted to sing. She's going to sing uh, My Lovely Horse. I had to introduce them quite slowly because, you know, I didn't want Dulcimer getting a giraffe killed. and the, yeah, a giraffe. Yeah, giraffes and, and horses are, horses. are historical I mean, enemies. Yeah, you know. they've got a long and bitter history. <laughs> oh, man. oh, I definitely needed this today. Um, and hello to John Rapp who just came in. Um, has ingressed the house. Why? Why, John? Why? <laughs> God damn it. Audrey Rabidou, hello. Oh, hang on. No, that's not what? right, is it? What? I wonder if Audrey Rabidou has any sheep deeps or beep deeps. Fuck off. Sheep are now called beep deeps, apparently. Indeed. I was I was explaining to people that um my nephew. No, what you said was like we went past a field of sheep and Keila went, Look, look, beep a deeps. No, I and now she's trying to turn it on her nephew. 
I yep. quietly said beep beeps because that's what my nephew calls me. Oh, you're jumping up and down yeah, in your no, seat no. and everything's so Of course I was. That's it. Back me up. Where yes. was the room? Where Absolutely was the fucking tusk. room? Hang on. Where was the room for me to jump up and down? Oh, she was, there was banging no her head room. on. She was banging her head on the, the, the roof of the cabin. Where was room? There room? I had to stop in case she hurt herself. There was no room. My dad was switching. Damn near can cussed herself at one yeah. point, man. Yeah, Lady Mountjoy, the, Lady Mountjoy the first get really upset and one of her hoofs almost like went through the window and everything. It was terrible. It was. Was that it when her head was sticking out the window? No. No, that was on the motorway. That was far too <laughs> dangerous. I just had this image of her head come flying off. <laughs> yeah, my nephew used to call sheep beep deeps so, so yeah, she's now called yeah. Beepa Deeps. So uh, I, I, I was sticking with this story now then, Crafty, because this, this is the third version we've heard of this. It was yeah, it was, this time, was it? Yeah, it was, a, it was a niece before, wasn't it? It was a niece before, and it was, no, it was a neighbour before that, I'm pretty sure. Uh, no, it wasn't. Or, or was it just it goes stuff? to show, just goes to show that lads don't listen. What? No offence, like, they already... No, no, no offense taken. I I didn't want to jump in and let you know that at the time, Taddy sent me a message on Discord. So I've got it all recorded, apparently. He, I don't know why he did it. It was weird. No, 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 I was no, 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 no. I thought it was very, it was out of nowhere. He sends me a message and he goes, dude, you will never fucking believe what Crafty calls the sheep. And I was like, what? What are you talking about? No, no, Rarity, Rarity, Rarity. Yeah. You, don't you, know have, you don't have to pretend. You don't have to pretend. <laughs> Taddy sent you nudes. We know this. We know Taddy sent you well, nudes. Well, those, hold up, hold up. Those were old messages. I just hadn't yeah, seen see? them. Yeah. Like, yeah. That's, be, that's before I'd met him properly. Yeah, yeah. He was much younger. He needed the money. You know. <laughs> so just, just, here's the thing. On uh, Sunday, probably not this Sunday, it's too late. Can we have a spot, the beep deep no, no, because she was stupid. No, but I'd love to see a spot mm. the beep deep competition. I'd Someone not. can go, I spotted the beep deep Well, well, on It'd be even better if Collie Wobble spotted the beep deep <laughs> <laughs> No. Um, no, what, what's going to happen is I have a surprise for um, for Steam and Cooper Reason on Sunday. Taddy is coming on. Yeah, and that's not a surprise. No, no, no. He knows that's not about a that. very good surprise. <laughs> the shittiest surprise in the world, that one. Surprise. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Yeah, surprise Ooh. doesn't mean doesn't mean good necessarily. Like <laughs> you know, oh, yeah. there can there can be a there can be a nail on the ground and you step on it. That's a surprise. Yeah, surprise. Um, apparently, the greatest rivalry in the animal kingdom is between penguins and polar bears. That's why you never see them in together in the wild oh, yes yeah. and and you know half the world yeah you know. here's a thing that no one ever talks about imagine how good penguins taste Ugh. can you imagine no i can't oh the, i bet they taste fucking there, there, there's a reason there's a reason why nobody talks about it because nobody thinks about it because it's no, nasty well, no there's a few things right i spent years trying to find um goose eggs and you can't buy them anywhere you can get duck eggs, chicken eggs, you know, quail eggs and so on. Uh, but not goose eggs, sorry, turkey eggs. And I was on, oh. why not? But I think if turkey's like, you know, it's expensive. It takes a long time to grow a turkey f for slaughter. So maybe it's just not cost efficient. But apparently they're absolutely disgusting. There you go. Maybe that's the, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> they're really thick and full of cholesterol. But you think someday I'll eat them, you know? There was some delicatessen somewhere where people eat things there is, like there is and stuff. I'll eat them. Is I'll it, eat them, absolutely. Is it legal to eat a penguin? Like, can you... Or, well, are you allowed to eat a penguin? We're, we're, we're discussing the most important questions on this channel. No, not not in the like, UK. Can, can they be deep fried? Well, that's the thing. Cause they're, made, they're made almost entirely of blubber, aren't they? Like seals. Mm. So I think yeah. deep frying yeah. them would be fraught with danger. I would advise <laughs> against it. Well, I, I mean, think if you penguin you jerky, them, right? Right? you Did put you like a nice thing of flour and some spices. Around I mean, it, to be know? honest with you, to be honest with you, I'd love right, to see well. secular rarity try it. <laughs> yeah, I'll go after after I'm off of here, y'all. I'll I'll make a promise to everyone. I'll I'll go look. <laughs> I'll go look <laughs> around my local my local grocery store, my butcher, just to see if he's got an oh, extra I mean, penguin. Yeah, it had to be a wild penguin. I think there's penguins in California. <laughs> 
You could probably get a wild penguin. There's a zoo That's not super far from no, me. I just on. don't know how they'd feel about well, me. I, 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 I feel. I'll, 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 oh, I can tell on, you they've got on. absolutely no sense of humor about that sort of thing at all. Oh, Chris, Chris Shapley, DVM CVA, uh, is an American veterinarian, and he says pe penguins are a protected species, so you're not yeah, allowed okay, to yeah. eat them. I thought protected that's from him. Uh, no they, must be, they must be delicious in for protection. Exactly. Yeah, but like swans. You know? No, mm. hang on, hang on. This this reminds me. Hello, of Sean. This reminds me of something real quick. Um, what's wrong with eating chocolate biscuits? Nothing. Although, if you're eating penguins, I found out recently that Tim Tams are no longer sold in Ireland, and I'm very sad about it. I was so fucking upset about it. I was like, no, there was one place in Dublin that used to do them, and now they don't anymore. I just wanted to point that out. There's no Tim Tams. Anyone that wants to send me Tim Tams, let me know, because I want Tim Tams. Anybody wants to send me the cash equivalent, let me know. Hi, Sean. Good to see you. See, the, the only people that understand my love of Tim Tams are the Aussies. Yeah, and Sean. Hardly... And Sean. Sean the Aussies it. are hardly up there with, like, you know, hot cuisine, are they? You know, Tim meat Tams pie floaters. Yeah. Tim Tams are amazing. Just because you don't understand it. Because you Chocolate can't... biscuits. You don't have the tolerance for chocolate. We know you're a lightweight. Chocolate, we get chocolate it. is rotten. I ate, actually I ate chocolate biscuits because we had to buy Nescafe for Tati. And the only way to get through a cup of cheap instant coffee is to have like five chocolate biscuits with it. Biscotti butter. Hmm. Interesting. No. I don't know. I don't know. I love my Tim Tams. There love comes a Tim point Tams. in everybody's life where they realise that a penguin is just a bourbon that's been dipped in chocolate. <laughs> and that just ruins biscuits forever. Never. Unless you like bourbons, which I, I do. Well, you can um, get a packet of bourbons, like 20 of them for like a quid. But you buy penguins and you get six for two quid. It's just the same fucking biscuit with extra chocolate. You're being ripped off. That's why I get the bourbons. And what you do, what you do is you get. Tusk is gonna retch now in a second. What no. you do? <laughs> just to piss him off. What you do is you get bourbon creams, and you put um, Nutella all around oh, it. Stop! Stop! No! No! Just Oh, that's just wrong and silly, <laughs> man. Jesus. Nutella. Please get me my Tim Tams. Get me my so Tim Tams and we won't have this conversation. I okay, get your own damn Tim Tams. No Tim Tams for Sheila. Indeed. Apparently. That, apparently. That kind of talk. Yeah, see how you like that. Right, everybody in the chat, make that a thing. Right? No <laughs> Tim Tams for Sheila. Right? And then we'll all go down Tim Tams and just deny her them. See how she likes it. Yeah. Ooh, see, Chris knows. Chris understands. He's going to uh, reach out to Black Market Chocolate Connections. <laughs> Thank you, Chris. You're going Chris to go understands. The dark, the dark Chris... chocolate web. Yeah, Chris understands. <laughs> dark chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> what? Okay, you need to try this, Rarity. You need to try this. I'm not trying this. You need to try it. Oh, I've already had. I've already had chocolate with oh, peppers chocolate in it. Paper. Yeah, it's really? delicious. Yeah, yeah. Spicy shit with your chocolate. It is fantastic. We if have a like Johnny O. What are them? Oh, hey. Johnny! If you can find um, Willy's Wonka chocolate factory chocolate, it's mm -hmm. like pure cacao. If you can get that with the chili in it, it is oh, absolutely okay. fantastic. Oh yeah, yeah. There's like a section at at one of my grocery stores close by. It's just like a wall of different grades of how much cacao is in it all the way up to like 95 yeah. percent it's nice. it gets i like dark chocolate but at that at that level of, of that's of, near food poisoning it's, right it's there. i mean it's rough yeah just yeah. just breaking off a bit of that by it's really for cooking so well there's a guy um i think he was i can't remember if he was english or american but he was like he worked in finance or something and one day he decided he was going to go to the amazon and farm chocolate and make the best chocolate he possibly could and it is fantastic but it never really took off unfortunately and i haven't seen it in the shops for a while so i don't know what happened to him can i just say i agree with john no barbecue, barbecue prawns. prawns why I, I didn't barbecue any prawns i did pork and um, what else did i do 
And Baron chicken, stole chicken. it all. Aye. And pork again. And potatoes. But I left them in too long and burnt the fuck out of them because I was quite drunk by that point. Never give a drunk right. Scotsman control of a barbecue. I did have the foresight to pull it far away from the window so it didn't, it didn't melt it or anything. Yeah. So, but that, but that, that, that was about funny. As that I, was really about funny. As bad as I got. You know. That was all the foresight you need. Yep. I didn't burn it down. Nice. Pretty successful day. Yeah, we have the plot hole. What's the story, so, man? Oh, you know, just dealing with standard YouTube bullshit. Gotta love it. Why? What's going on? Yay. Yeah, it's the same old, same old song and dance. You know. You oh, have... you got copyright strike there. Oh yeah, I got a copyright oh, strike fuck. from from Story uh, Storyful Managed. Those guys are those guys are just they're habitual, right? They they do this show all the time to everybody. They're excitable. Uh, they really are. And there was one complaint where they copyright claimed somebody's original content. Like they they put up a video of their own business. And Storyful Managed like, "No, nope, that's ours." And the guy, because of the way YouTube's process is, the guy has to appeal to Storyful Managed. Like, hey, no, this is my video. This is my stuff. I recorded this is my footage. Like, nope, nope, it's ours. So he had to file appeal. And like, nope, it's ours. And if you don't take it down, we're going to hit you with a copyright strike. Oh, fun. Uh, yeah. yeah. Because YouTube. Yeah. Yeah. I, I, I've, I, only I, been, I, I've only been copyright struck once. And it I've wasn't been, really a copyright strike, it was more of a copyright claim. Just a content claim, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got a copyright strike twice from the Orchard Music on my own music, but I had to take my own music down because they claimed it was theirs. Oh, yeah, and same thing happened to me. Yeah, I couldn't prove it was mine, so I had to take it down. That's some bullshit. Fucking ridiculous. I woke up one morning with that email from YouTube. Copyright claim has been... Put on your video, blah 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 blah. I went and looked. So what? What are you talking about? It was a live stream. I went and looked at it, and it said that Invasion It has claimed your music. I said, "Are you fucking kidding me? I'm Invasion It. I didn't fucking claim my music." <laughs> oh, the fun! Well, it's so bullshit. Anyway, <clears throat> second best yeah. Bob. I have not been working on my OnlyFans site. Yes, he has. Only some of us got the link. Shh. Well, now you're telling everybody. Yeah, but I want to make them jealous. But, but <laughs> if you want, to, if you want to join, if you want to join uh, Johnny's OnlyFans, it's www.paypal slash tusk slash com, <laughs> and it's, it's fifty dollars a week. Apparently, nobody has ever claimed uh, copyright claimed Clive's. Isn't that because you all you do your own stuff? You don't have anyone else's. Or do you even make videos? I was gonna oh, say, he how does, many, and how, they're how in many? depth. They're in I depth. Know. It's because nobody like can it. understand them. That's what it is. That's it. That's it. We know we're speaking English, but like, hmm. yeah, I watch a Clive Wells video. I'm like, man, I, I have a degree in English, but I don't understand. I know what you're. I know the. I, I recognize that you're speaking English words. Yeah. What they mean in yeah. sequence. None of yeah. this makes any sense. Oddly, I get that a lot too. That's yeah. because you don't speak English. You speak you speak Tusk. Oh well, Tusk Tusk had a very special friendship <sighs> down in uh Barnes. Oh, that bloody oh, women. <laughs> <laughs> very special oh, friend. Sweet Jesus. You, you, you know sometimes friend, man. Right, if you go abroad. And the person there doesn't speak English, and you end up going off oh, for fuck's sake. And you try to mime what it is you want, or you, you know, I end up fucking flapping my hands around, shouting bird seed for fuck's sake, women, bird seed. <laughs> to I have feed a funny story birds. about that when you're done. Well, t well, I went into the shop and I um, or just bought what I wanted. I went and said hello, and she's like, hello, and then she's like, oh my, I can't understand you. So, okay, we're here already. Oh, you know, all of us said hello. <laughs> yeah. So I said, right, I just want things for breakfast, sausage, beans, eggs, that kind of thing, breeding that. She said, nope, no idea. So I ended up just pointing out the things I wanted. <laughs> then for some reason, she yep. got them off the shelf, handed them to me, and then made me shout out the prices. 
<laughs> but surely you could have done that as you took them off the shelf. Like, do you know what? Never mind. You're obviously insane. This is, this is okay, you know. So at the end of it, I decided I wanted some bird seed because I'd seen quite a lot of small uh, hedgerow birds and songbirds in the garden. It's a huge big garden. So I said, do you have any bird seed? Sorry, what? Bird seed. You know, seed for birds to feed the birds. No, no idea what I was talking about. I said, come on, women, bird seed. What's difficult about that? She said, bed seed. What the fuck's bed seed? <laughs> it's not even a thing. But she she was struggling. She she got seed, but she couldn't get bird from that. So I ended up standing in the middle of the shop flapping my arms around like a bird <laughs> Well, Tatty's outside the shop going, pigeons, sparrows, birds, you fucking idiot, you know, birds, <laughs> shouting out the names of different birds while I'm standing there flapping my fucking arms around like an idiot. It turned out they didn't have any in any case. But there's oh, other I... customers standing outside the shop just looking at the two of us going, not getting involved, <laughs> I'm staying out of this. <laughs> you know what I mean? That's fucking great. I wish we could have seen that. Oh, I wish I was there. Because me, me and Tusk went on a walk then later. No, and then we came no, back. No, stop, 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 stop. No, Tusk I'm not and saying. I went on a walk. <laughs> me and Tusk went on a walk. And then on our way back, he pulls me and he's like, uh, Your one was coming up. And she was like, Oh, not you again. And he's like, Look, I brought my translator. Isn't it lovely when somebody like, greets you with, oh my god, not you again? Not you again. <laughs> well, thanks very fucking much. That's why I gave you one star review. She probably oh, thinks them. that one star review is a good thing. Tell them your review. Or can, uh, did you actually yes. submit the review? Oh, yeah, it's up there. Yeah. Yes. Read it. it. Read it. Well, if I read but it, we... no one will understand it. So Hang send on. me the link, though. I'll send you the link to it. I'll look for that now. So, Johnny, you had a story you were going to tell? Well, it's not really my story. It's my father's story. But he was stationed in uh, in Germany during Vietnam. And <clears throat> he and my his best friend of, uh, yeah, best friend of all time, uh, his name is Green. And he's a black guy. And they were having a party on base for something. And they needed a black light. So they go to the hardware store. And they walk up to the the counter and speak to the clerk there uh, now my father knows broken german at best and he was you know uh, you know hello my name is whatever i'm looking for and he knew how to say, he didn't know how to say black light so he got to that point and he pointed at you know the, point he, he pointed at his friend he, go, he goes <laughs> we, you know, we, we need a black and <laughs> this is the 70s man this is definitely the 70s <laughs> yeah oh yeah this is in the 70s so he he uh he points at, at green and says you know i need a black and then he points at a light black light and then the clerk he says the clerk just looks at him with this confused look and then they keep they do this for a good five ten minutes and the clerk looks at him and says in perfect fucking english oh you need a black light <laughs> so i have found it oh, i have found the review this is the review from dulcimer small cat <laughs> the site is situated between here and there, but not too close to one or the other. So it would be good for the ner for the nervous or the unsure. Fucking hell. <laughs> that notwithstanding, there are a few issues that I would like to address. <laughs> <laughs> What's worse? I know exactly the tree that he's talking about, but number one. <laughs> There is a tree that moved quite suggestively in the breeze. Absolutely not suitable <laughs> for children. Fucking hell. <laughs> Number two, a small bird, possibly a robin, winked at me. Come on, Crafty. You can do, you can do it. it. Come on now. <laughs> oh, no, that, I think you broke her. Thoughts, I, think I think you broke her. Would someone like to take over? <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
<laughs> Small bird, possibly a robin, winked at me. I believed it, and the aforementioned tree were working together. I wish you would have put in cahoots or something like that. Something weird. <laughs> Around mid-afternoon, a cow in the opposite field mooed out of key with a song that was playing on the radio. It spoiled the ambience a bit. The farmer should tune them properly. <laughs> 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 There's a shop in a nearby village where a customer wore odd socks two days in a row. How is that allowed to happen? I'm also pretty sure he was wearing a toupee that upset my dog. <laughs> oh, can you? I think my Gosh. favorite part is that you traveled there on business. Yeah, I think that's. Business. <laughs> <laughs> oh, serious business. Like, oh. Like, what, what the hell do you do for a living, man? Like, talking, I'm a lawyer. About, <laughs> talking about the, the keys of cows and. Well, I was, I was sitting out in the garden kind of mid afternoon. It was absolutely lovely. And there was a, there was a, a song playing on the radio. I can't remember what song it was. It's like in the generic rock song on the radio. And I heard a murm out in the distance. There was a, a cow. I feel the cows like 100 yards or so away. But it was completely oh, out of key with the song that was on the radio. And I said, no, that really got my back up. That actually really annoyed me. I thought, I'm going to bring that up. Do you think it was sharp or do you think it was a little flat? Oh, it was definitely flat. Absolutely. Oh, okay. Definitely okay. Flat. That's, that's good. That's good. If the cow was sharp, I would have been concerned. But yeah, yeah. Well, it really <laughs> just depends on what key you're in. The cow could have been sharp. Good point. Well, good point. <laughs> well the cow could have been sharp. Well, it, it's, it can't be out of key with itself, I suppose. <laughs> no, that way, <laughs> madness lies. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's so, too far. The rest of that review is perfectly Yeah, same, yeah exactly. That last one. Well, well, that's funny. what they get for making me flap my fucking arms around. <laughs> well, what's funny is um, he sent it to us, to us sent it to us um, before he posted it. And when I was reading it, I was like, oh, he's talking about that tree. Me, me and Tati were, were sitting in the, the front room. And I was like, oh, it was, it's that tree that he's talking about. So we both knew exactly which tree Tusk yeah. was talking about. There's a tree and, and, uh, which, in a certain breeze, not to put too paint, fine a point on it, looks exactly like a willy. A little bit. A little bit. Please, yeah. oh. Well, That's... it looks like my willy in any case. <laughs> <laughs> Well, on the willy note and the out of key cow, oh. I must be off because oh. I have a few dogs to tune. <laughs> is that a euphemism? Exactly what it is. Exactly what it is. Enjoy your puppies. Oh. All right, guys. Lots of hugs. Okay. See Always. you, Johnny. Cheers. Thanks for coming in, Johnny. Yay. Oh, Christ. So I was going to leave the comments in the little book that was in the cottage we were in. But I thought, no. No. Yeah, put it out there for everybody. Put it out there. Yeah, yeah. Just, I think it's just my own ego wouldn't allow that maybe like no one would see it. Yeah. And I wanted them to know that I was unhappy with being made to flap my hands around. And <laughs> well, I feel, feel like, like I feel like, like if they did get enough. that, if they <laughs> read that review and don't understand that that you were unhappy about having to flap your arms. Well, I mean, it was clearly spelled out yeah. in the review. Well, they, they left a comment. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, oh did they? Yeah, they did. <laughs> it's not the comment I was expecting, to be honest. <laughs> oh um yeah pro response uh hi small cat thank you for putting a smile on all our faces have a good day yay so they saw I the funny side thanks one for one star <laughs> out of a possible five those people have they knew who exactly you mark. were i don't think they got me from that ah they did <laughs> Nah, we were the know. only one. We were the only ones. We were the I only. Ones. We were the only people there. <laughs> well, we were the only yeah. fuckers there, eh? Right? <laughs> <laughs> well, and they knew what you were like, and they knew we knew Berman. So. Yeah, but I don't know. Yeah. Well, anyway, I, I think they know exactly who it was. Well, if they know who it is, they know exactly why they got their one star then. <laughs> Bastards. <laughs> well, before uh... then, they probably sent it all in. Before we Probably get into much it. more, I I have to I have to go bounce and I don't have a dog to tune or anything, but um, I I I have a deep fryer coming, y'all. It 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 is, 
and yes. uh, get some get some uh, recipes together. And Crafty and I'll talk and and see how she wants to do the stream. I'm I'm open for uh, like doing a live, like me having to cook the shit right in front of you. If if that's what that y'all want, yeah, we'll just I'll just have to set up some things in a precarious situation like a deep a deep fryer near my my whole computer and camera and stuff seems like it might not be the best idea but again i'm offering that yeah i'm offering that if that's what the people want that's the only reason i got this thing anyway because crafty showed up somewhere and yelled at me about it so (laughs) (laughs) i've been been low-key stalking secularity (laughs) It's been fun. It's been fun. Sweet. That, Sweet. that doesn't surprise me. And the You've been slightest. what? Low-key low key stalking? Low-key stalking. Oh, low-key. I thought it meant low-key. I'll be, like, as I'll be low looking key. out low more key. now. I mean, I felt a weird presence the last couple of times I've been somewhere. So it's good to know that it's just you and not somebody else, I guess. I guess. No, no, it's definitely me. It's definitely yeah. me. I don't know um, if I... I don't know if I should feel better about that. But. <laughs> it's been fun. You, you and Puck, you and Puck, I've just been <laughs> low-key kind of stalking just to like push your buttons. It's great. It's good fun. It works. It works. So es- Especially especially in, in the chats where you don't have a wrench and I just keep <laughs> saying that you're naked and everyone around is like, what? <laughs> Yes, yes. It's much truer than than people realize. Like I I was at the grocery store completely naked. Got a lot of strange looks. So, I mean, I had my mask on, but nothing else. So, uh <laughs> all right. All right. On that note, I'll I'll fuck Rarity off. Rarity is a, is abandoning the stream. That's right. I'm egressing. We are abandoned. We are That's abandoned. right. That's right. I would stay for another, you know, 33 minutes, but uh, I just <laughs> All right. So Tara, then. Such love, gravity. <laughs> gravity. What? Such love, gravity. <laughs> Thank you, Rarity, for popping in. Um, this has been fun. This has been fun, lads. We're still going. We're still going. I don't give oh, yeah. a fuck. Just uh, for people who are listening to this nonsense, I know it sounds like I spent the entire time you were away acting like a prick. Oh, we did. But I, I didn't really. Most of the time, we I did. just sat on my arse or went to the pub. <laughs> acting like a prick. Acting like a prick. <laughs> yeah, I suppose actually, yeah. Now you mention it. Yeah. But that's Fair why enough. we love you. That's why we love you. That was too much fun, man. Uh, was... Too much fun. My f- uh, honestly, my favourite part of the entire thing was uh Even Song in the cathedral. That was absolutely beautiful. That was that was class. That was amazing. I know it's like people get, probably got bored after about 10 minutes, but I absolutely loved it. No, it was. It was stunning. If you're down in Hereford and you get a chance to go to the evening song in Hereford Cathedral, please do. Um, <laughs> you got a, a reading from your favourite um, um, text. Yeah, the Revelation of St. John. Yeah. I thought we were going to get some... Well, there was. They did do one reading about um, Nep- Nicodemus. If I pronounce, I probably butchered that, and the golden uh, statue, but they padded it out by just repeating everybody's names over and over again. Yep. And I was like, <laughs> surely you must have read this part before. And I went, wait a fucking minute here. Nothing happened. Nothing happened here at all. But if we just pad it out and make make us read everybody's name and all the instruments they played in the band, then we can drag it on for like a whole chapter. But yeah, if you get a chance to go to the not not just Hereford Cathedral, any cathedral that's got a choir and a full size organ, and go to Evensong because it's usually quite uh, quiet there; it's not busy, and just listening to a, a proper choir in a cathedral which was built to house the choir and the organ, it's absolutely fantastic. Yeah, because there are a few places that have the the proper organs nowadays. Yeah, a lot of them uh, they weren't maintained because the churches simply couldn't afford them after the Reformation, but now uh, people have kind of realised that it is, you know, a huge part of history, so they've been um, rebuilt and restored and it's absolutely great to hear them. It is, because when they don't do it, they, they use that fucking tape, you know, pre-recorded yeah. stuff and yeah. it's, it's, no, it's, it's just, not good. It, it's, it's wrong, man. It's I've, when, the, op- it's when the, the fully restored organ in the Kelvin Grove Museum Aye. was uh, started being played again on like a Sunday afternoon. It's bizarre music a lot of the times. It's not what you're used to. You know, there's no sense of melody or anything, but it's 
it's an experience. Um, so Tani, really? <laughs> For two quid says wow. super chat deleted by Crafty Keela. I would not delete a super chat. I'm not that bad. Well I'm not that bad. <laughs> I'm it, mad. It was, it was a link to Johnny O's uh, OnlyFans, so I can I can understand why oh, you did okay, it. Okay. Oh yeah. Again, if you want to join Johnny's OnlyFans, it's <laughs> www.husk at PayPal. Dot fifty quid. <laughs> Not 50 quid. <laughs> <laughs> Not 50 Yeah, I need a new fishing rod for next season. And it's really fucking expensive. <laughs> yeah, we didn't get any um, fishing in this weekend. Or this week. No, I was actually... I was actually... Uh, a week wasn't long enough nah. to do all the things I wanted to do. Nimrod, really? <laughs> <laughs> See what you started, Taddy. See what you started, Oops. asshole. Um, for yeah. twenty sex says sex retracted by Crafty che Checo. Okay, you'll get gulagged by Comrade Kraftchenko before you know it. <laughs> Sent for re-education. Oh, oh. No, no, just no. I'm not. In the salt. Oh, what was that task? What, 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 what was that task? No, I can't remember now. Oh, 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 what? Oh. What? Oh no. Oh, oh. The power's <laughs> going to your head. I see. Yep. Yep. Um oh, no, we'll play I have down, been asked see. I have been asked to bring the brats back. Um so in a couple of weeks, uh <laughs> we're gonna have another gaming stream. We are gonna have another gaming Ooh. stream with Jonesy and Millie. They're coming oh, back. Oh, is this uh, right? I suppose it'll be too late because you'll skill them. <gasps> I've already schooled them, biatch. Yeah. So, so this week, both my niece and nephew took part in a school-wide science um, quiz, I suppose. And Jonesy was on the winning team. Millie was came second. Millie's team came second. So, na 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 na. Schooled. Nice. Boom. No, I won't Basically. stop muting you either. I, I'm not muting you. I'm I'm kicking you out. <laughs> Why though? Because it's fun. But because you know I was going to say. <laughs> oh, you sick! You sick puppy. <laughs> it is fun. <laughs> no. Simply put, no, Clive. Clive, you should come on this chat as well. I, I think. I think. Beyond censoring, I'm not censoring anyone. I think Clive Wells should get on this chat. Well, Sen Clive is um, uh, not partly responsible for me getting my horse. So, Clive yeah, should come on the chat. Yeah, stop Clive. aggressing me. <laughs> but it's fun. Clive, send me an email, craftykeela at gmail.com, and we'll get you on the stream. And you can tell me that to, to my face. <laughs> Bring it, bitch! No, seriously, seriously though, send me an email and I'll I'll send you the link. <laughs> still waiting, still waiting. We're we're not we're we're not going anywhere until fucking Clay Wells gets his ass on this stream, and then we'll go. Yeah, then we'll fuck off <laughs> yep. and leave him here. As soon as he joins. <laughs> Come on, Clive. He's like, I'm doing stuff. I'm I'm being an adult. Is he? He's able to be an adult and a troll all, all at the same time. Scary. Yeah, it's, it's exhausting. It really is. I feel your pain. I don't adult, so it's fine. I don't, oh, I don't know. Too. You did all the booking and all the rest of it. The yeah. booking? Oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I I organize stuff. I'm too frightened of crowd. Come on, I'll I'll be nice, ish. She won't be nice. She'll do what she does to me. Yeah, she'll come on, Clive. Just boot me out and mute. <laughs> like that. What was that? Exactly like that. <laughs> it's Aww. just it's Crafty can egress. Can egress you if you would just join. Well, I 
I think I'll keep him on just to poke oh. at him a little bit. Um, Nate and eight second best pop. Knight. Knight. So many people have left, which is understandable. Yeah. Everybody yeah. leaves. Uh, <laughs> John Rapper, two Aussie daughters, says ha, Aussie messages are what? Um, imperv. Imperv. <laughs> imperv <laughs> impervious to your stop fucking kicking me out. <laughs> I didn't. You fucking didn't know, did. Was I that didn't. you? Nobody oh, kicked you. You weren't kicked. I. I Are you watching the live stream while you're on the stream? Because you know that's behind <laughs> us. Yeah. I know that, but it was not that far behind. Oh, obviously it was. <laughs> Oh, you please. do that often that I don't even know when you're doing it anymore. I can be halfway through a sentence and I get fucking booted out. Booted. Oh, no, so she's cruel. She Hi, cruel. Demon. We have Demon Orb in the chat. Mm -hmm. um, bring on Gary Libenga. No, fuck Gar Gary, Gary Libenga. Gar Gary right. runs away from my streams. He's, he's right. not on my stream. He, he doesn't like um, StreamYard anyway. I've tried to engage with Gary Libenga on like just an everyday normal level you know just chatting but he always reverts to type and i just i'm kind of be fucking bothered with him anymore i'm done with him oh, he was on sean hawkins stream today copy and pasting the same crap he was doing like two years ago yeah but you see sean lets him he doesn't no, do I, that I on my streams because he knows he's gonna get booted so no, he, he did doesn't it once, do it yeah. he did it once and i timed him out and just said look you do it again you're getting timed out and he did that again so he got timed out and then it just became the bubble wrap you know everybody was just timing him out and i thought oh, yeah. who sits with like he must have a script a folder somewhere yep. like a word file full of these fucking misquotes and cherry pick statements that he copy and paste so what a, what a life a <laughs> I mean, who does that you know Says a man who ran around a car park with a hobby horse. Yeah, I know, but that's absolutely. That's, I was like a superhero, right? With, with an invisible cape. I was hobby horse man. Hobby oh, horse man. That's that's my new superpower. Whatever danger strikes. It's hobby horse man to the rescue. Oh damn it! Hang on, I should have had that ready. Hang on. Yeah. It's hobby horse man to the rescue. Like that. Indeed. Yeah. I've got it between my legs now. Oh. <laughs> For fuck's sake. <laughs> I gave her a new hairstyle as well. I back oh, I back combed nice. it and spiked it up so it's like a kind of kind of gothy mohawk thing kind of thing. It doesn't help that she's, you know, ginger. You can't really have a ginger goth. <laughs> But, a ginger go. Yeah. <laughs> well, I don't know. I mean, they're both getting a, vers a severe aversion to sunlight. Maybe. It's not that I've got anything against um, redheads or anything like that. It's just, mm. it's difficult to look all dark and mysterious when you've got, you know, a big ginger mohawk. I suppose, <laughs> and you're a horse. But... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it doesn't help that you're a horse. That's got something to do with it, I suppose. I'm sorry. I didn't mean that. I didn't mean how you're feeling. Uh, Jen says, um, hobby horses are more fun than any flurf. Of course they are. The horse... Well, I, I'd rather ride my horse than any of the flurfs. <laughs> I'm sure you would. I, I'm, I'm, hardly, any of them jump, yeah, hardly any of them could jump over those barriers in the car park. Except maybe Gigantor, he could just step over them. <laughs> He'd step over them. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Bob Nadell's gyroscope. I'm sure Gary has a lot of people blocked. He, he doesn't really do well um, when it comes to interacting with others. Well, does not play well with us. He is the only person, I think, the only person I've blocked from my channel. Like, I'm just, I'm done with him. Chris says you don't want the cape. The Incredibles taught us that much. <laughs> Yeah, I'll just get caught in the fences and stuff when I'm out galloping. And in the forest when I'm out, you know, pony trekking. I don't want it getting caught up. Pony trekking. You, you don't know oh, that I've been taking her out and stuff already in the back garden and <laughs> introduced her to the neighbour's cat. 
<laughs> what does uh, what does you, what's the budgie think? She's it's, it's great. She's absolutely terrified of it. <laughs> All I did was put the head in the cage and wriggle it around, going, "It's a fucking horse! It's a fucking horse!" And the budgie went into a complete panic. I don't know why. And then and then you wonder why the was... budgie doesn't like you. No, I've I've cultivated that. <laughs> That's <laughs> deliberate. I think the, the budgie was just that excited about seeing a horse that couldn't move. Might have been maybe petrified with excitement. Indeed. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, so, Shat itself in joy. <laughs> like, like I said, um, the gaming streams are coming back. Um, ish, ish. Uh, so let me know in the comments what you'd like to see us play because Among Us is one of them. Um, and the brats do have Among Us. They also have Fall Guys. So, um, and a few others. So let us know what you'd actually like to see us play. Um, and there might be gaming streams where there is no brats, but I don't see that happening very often because they're 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 my reason to play games. Oh, I don't know about that. Your excuse to play, yeah. Games. Excuse to play, yeah. Let's get, let's <laughs> get the they're, correct, yeah. yeah, they're your cover yeah. for playing games. Let's, yeah. I don't know. The last time we played Among Us, you just started shouting at everybody, and it was. <laughs> <laughs> I, didn't I like enjoy Among it. Us. I like Among Us. Stop fucking doing that. Do this. Do that. Why are you doing that? For fuck's sake. When was this? Um, a couple of weeks ago, we played the the stabby in the dark one. Hide and seek. Oh, yeah. the hide and seek because people yeah, don't know how you, to fucking play yeah, it. And you got so ratty. People don't know how to play <laughs> it. it really you have to you let know. them learn. <laughs> <laughs> you do, and they still don't fucking learn. You see, oh, this is what, it's, it's, this is what it's like to play games with Kayla. <laughs> she I, doesn't seem to take any fun in it at all. Yeah, I do. I just, and it annoys me when people just don't get basic rules. This is, this is how I feel when you say Tatty and me. No, I say me and Tatty. Or me and Tatty, right? Or me <laughs> and Etty. That's how it feels. Like that sign from the other day. Nah. That rubs me oh. right up. And you're pretending you didn't yeah. know what was wrong with it. It wasn't funny. Do you want to put it up? No, I don't have Go it. Go on. Oh, you do. No, I, d I delete all my... At the end of the day, I delete everything off my desktop and empty the recycle bin. Why? Like you should... that, that's exhausting. Hang on, I get it. Hang on, I get it. Just so people understand what we're talking about. Right, everybody in the chat, will under hopefully you'll understand this, why this just rubbed me right up the wrong way. It's oh, and it's not. And it's not. I a I, I found it hilarious. Nearby brick. I don't know. I don't know why you got so upset. Yes, you do. You know exactly why I got upset. Just because you wouldn't get as upset by it doesn't mean you don't understand why it upset me. This is true. Uh, this is true. A, I I don't know why you'd get upset. Snigger, snigger, snigger. Yeah, mainly. Mm. I got upset because you pretended you didn't know why it upset me. I knew you were pretending because I know perfectly well that you understand the English language at least that well. And why this was such a poorly constructed and contradictory sentence that I, I can't let it stand. I'm going to have to go into the shop and tell them to take it down. Or put a comma in at least. Yeah. But that, that'd probably just <laughs> make it worse. Poor punctuation. It's not just poor punctuation. It's a, it's, it's a tautology. Grand, grand comma opening sale. Oh yeah, let it now. You've got look at look at that. Oh fucking <laughs> that rips my knitting. It really does. <laughs> that annoys me so much. Oh, I love it. No, I think. Oh, and what's most... funny? What, what's funny is that it's in a display case or it's on a display case with nothing. Which is otherwise empty. Yeah, that just makes it worse. <laughs> but to I, I, people I'm in the chat, I'm tell me it. you can see what's wrong with that sign. It's oh fuck me! It's been there for weeks, and I've only I've, I was in a couple of weeks ago <laughs> and it was there, and I went oh, for Christ's sake, <laughs> you'll take it down. You know, it's how long is the opening sale going on for? And it's still there two weeks later. And if it's there next time again, I'm going to have to go in and say, right, come on. Uh, yeah, apparently, people see. aren't seeing it. Yeah. 
Oh, well, it's, it's on the stream. It's on the stream. No, I don't know if they're saying they're not seeing what's wrong with it or they're not seeing the sign. Either way, you're, you're a bunch of bloody liars because you, you can see it <laughs> and you can see what's wrong with it. That annoyed me so much that I took a picture of it and put it up yeah. on Discord and Facebook and I went, Nick, just get it fucking down. Get it down, get it down, get it down. Yeah, sign the move, move right out. <laughs> But see, they all understand why that is just yeah. fucking, you know, it's like nails on a blackboard. Oh, it's so funny. How can everything, everything be thirty pound on selected items? Yeah. Either everything's thirty pound or less, or it's thirty pound or less on selected items. It can't be both. Oh, that's I mean, selected. Tusk, fucking Tusk. infuriating. Tusk. What? Tell us how you really feel. I just did. It just right now. <laughs> the green grocer's apostrophe annoys me. Right, unnecessary punctuation is infuriating but this this here is beyond that this is the man runs a business how are you going to run a business like that no wonder his shop's fucking empty yeah because he sold walk, everything people are going to walk past that and just go oh no I'm not going in there no because they're going to read that sign and even in if they don't understand it you know they've only got like a wee fuzzy half brain or something that somewhere in there is going to just rub the wrong way, and it's going to they're going to walk past and go, "That's not right," but I don't quite know why. Like when you see a salad and you suspect it's got celery in it, so you just don't touch it just in case. Case the sneaky celery. Yeah, that's that's what that will do to people. They walk past and they go, "Oh God, no, I'm not going in there." And that yeah, drives me mad. Yeah, just to, to let everyone that's watching know that there there will be at some point in the near future, uh, there there will be a tape of your favourite Tusk rants, and uh, you can yeah. you can you, you can you can pre order them now by putting your name below. Oh, fuck you! <laughs> How can you pre order something? I was waiting for <laughs> order it. How can you? You can't pre order it. I hate that. I've I've unfriended people in real life for fucking saying that and using that. My favourite bands who put up pre-order the album now. I'm oh, not no. sorry. We are no longer friends. We it. can no longer be I friends. I was considering. Oh look 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 Jin Jin. Yep. As your oh. ringtones, pre-order them now. Shut the fuck up. You Only know that put an option to prepay. No, you can, strictly <laughs> speaking. <laughs> Pre-pay. Right. But strictly all you've speaking. done is you've paid. You, have, you know, the, the pre is it's an unnecessary. It's like people say, oh, this is quite unique. No, unique is an absolute. It doesn't require any qualifier. You can't be quite unique or totally unique or... As Clive will say, is very unique. No, unique is an absolute. It doesn't need a qualifier. It's very that, unique in that respect. That, yep. that annoys the living shit out of me. <laughs> Turtle Moose asks, what's wrong with the grocer's apostrophe? Oh, then he's, he's deliberately put one in there. <laughs> <laughs> well, it could be more than one grocer. No. Even then, that that's <laughs> unnecessary. <laughs> I I do. I fear for the impoverishment of the English language. I really do. It's like people that say "of" instead of "have." I would have done that. <coughs> no, I do that all the time. I do that all the time. Uh, but you don't write it, do you? No, I don't write it. But no, I, I, I say it all the time. Or people say, "Oh, I'm. Oh, I don't know. I'm quite weary of that." No, you're weary of that. Weary is something completely different. Turtle Moose has it right. Pay now, buy later. <sighs> <laughs> it's all. Tusk is, it, Tusk is counting to ten in his head right now. Yeah, I'm. I'm counting to ten to give the anger time to build up. Right. <laughs> it's it's the pre prefix. 
which ironically is like a, a <laughs> it's like, oh he's been pre-warned no he has been warned how can you pre-warn somebody you simply warn them it drives me fucking mad uh, preheated well you can preheat an oven you can heat it prior to putting whatever food you're going to put in it but that'd be uh, heat it prior to ingress I suppose <laughs> win a free gift and you don't even have to pay a, a single penny fucking free gift is the one free that gift, yes. most. Yes. That, that's the one that annoys me more than anything of course it's mm -hmm. free it's a gift a gift <laughs> it's free by definition Hello, if you're around, pop in. I'll, I'll send you the link on Discord. No, um, all, all they're doing, Blue, is just saying things that they know annoy me. Now, a while ago, I was thinking about setting up a wee side channel called Trigger Tusk. Where it was just... Oh, I have a great one on that. <laughs> but I know, but I was on, this was months ago I was talking about it, but nothing came of it. And the other night, um, maybe yesterday, in fact, on Seek Truth, Speak Truth, uh, Limey Play said he's going to do something similar, which is going to be him ranting on about stuff. Well, he can do that then. At least people understand what he's saying. Yeah, but half the fun is trying to work out what you're saying. So oh, I okay. think you should definitely do it. Uh, but now, see, most people now know my triggers. So. Yeah, but it's still fun to get a, 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 it all in one place, like a little. Although I'm, I'm going to tell you this now, if you do that, if you do that, you are going to be followed around like the vampire banjo. Oh, fucking vampire banjo. It wasn't even a fucking bam banjo, vampire banjo. It was a fucking triffid. As if that makes it any better. Right. <laughs> but the banjo vampire was, that's, that's on Cheese Mondo. I'll, he'll pay for that. I don't know how. You but say one day, that. somehow, he'll pay for what he's done. You say that. I I, well, I think he's gotten the last laugh there, man. Well, it was the no, only sorry. last I, I have gotten the last laugh. <sighs> How so? Because I keep bringing it up. I know. Great. But if somebody one day, <laughs> if, if an Amazon driver pulls up and brings out a Triffid... <laughs> <laughs> That that will be the last laugh, and it will literally be, you know, the last laugh. Clive, I'm I'm dead. I'm dead. I I don't know exactly where you're from, Clive, <laughs> but I have we'll a certain skill set. <laughs> I will find you. Oh, no, I just I, it's, it's the hyperbole you see on on these like YouTube videos. Oh, this is so unique. Ah, I'm going to kill you. I know it's, it might seem petty to people, but I do like unsub from channels if they keep using language like this is so, so unique. Here, here's my question. Here's my question. Why the fuck haven't you unsubbed from me? Because you're probably the only person that still lets me on stream so I can talk <laughs> about that shit. <laughs> no one else will let me on their stream. Oh, you can come on my stream at any time. Some people not in that way, Tally. No, no, not in that uh, way. Before you start, now some oh. people have me on once, but it's usually only once. <laughs> oh, I love having you on stream. Yeah, just so you I can really mock do. me and make fun yes. of me. Yes, yes. This is That's like an good. hour and a half, and all we've done so far is make fun of me, and not worse than that, have me make fun of myself. <laughs> That's why people love you, because you're able. You're not. You're not a fucking dry shy. You're one of the people who is able to uh, laugh themselves, and that's that's awesome. Well, I, I don't I don't have much choice. <laughs> uh, more importantly, you can laugh at other folks too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what they're for. We're gonna have fun with secular rarity. I I have to say. Who? Your best friend. Mm. Your bestest bestest buddy. We're gonna have good fun. Making him Nimrod, and stuff. after after I found the goat for you and everything, that's how you're going to that's how you're going to do it, is it? Whoa, wait, what, what, what? Oh. Is Nimrod cheating? No, 
Look what, oh. look what he's written, though. Oh. Was Nimrod cheating and getting other people to find the gopher? <laughs> no, 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 not at all. <laughs> if you want, I can pre or pre clear a pre order oh. and pre pay for a dragon that's pre unique. Nasty. Pretty unique, maybe. Pretty unique, maybe. Pre, aye, pre unique. We have Big Blue! Hello, hello. 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 It's been a while. How are you doing? I'm doing fine. Keila, how you doing? I'm hey. good. Teddy, Tusk, what are you guys up to? I'm oh, doing, hey, doing all right, doing all right. Yeah, it's kicking on, mate, kicking on, kicking on. Good to hear your voice, my man. Hi. Yeah, great, man. I haven't talked I'd... to any of you guys in quite a while. Yeah, I know. I had great fun watching your thingy, your Cavendish, because sometimes I was watching it before 14, and then this is the best bit, like a minute later, it'd be 4.15. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> It was, oh, he wouldn't yeah. shut up about it fucking for the other week, man. Yeah. yeah, yeah, he was very proud of you. Yeah, I'm starting to miss Kevin. If old Henry got to be sort of part of the family here, but uh, yeah. he doesn't was live that... too far away, so I can go visit him. Yeah, you know. it's in a museum now, yeah. yeah. Huh? Is it in a, a museum now? A no, no, it's a university. A university, right? Okay. Yeah, nice. University of Tennessee. Awesome. They, they've got it. Fantastic. They've got it all set up. I made a, I made one more trip down there and uh, and sort of well, more or less got it adjusted, I think. But uh, sometime in the next month or so, they're going to be actually running it, and uh, they want me to come down and Yay. hang out, hang out with the kids yes. and help them make some actual measurements. And I'm looking forward to that. I'll make okay. some video. Does, does um does your basement seem empty without it? Oh, totally, absolutely. Like yeah, I, I can, I can imagine Blue just standing in the middle of a scene. Echo, echo. <laughs> <laughs> you you yeah. do have an absolutely awesome workshop. Ah, uh, thank you. Uh, yeah, it, it seems pretty empty now. You're right. Without the, without Cavendish in there, we can barely walk around that thing. With yeah. it. it was using up so much space. I didn't realize how much it did use up till I got rid of it. Well, uh, didn't get rid of it. But I mean, until I moved it out. Yeah. Oh, um, You'll not be missing no having to tiptoe about as well, man. Hmm? Yeah. Go on. Rob says, yeah, I imagine Blue's wife's glad to see you go. Yeah, no, nah, not really. She was happy enough. It kept me busy. Now yeah, I'm back keep, in her hair all the time, so. Yeah, it keep you out of the way down in your man cave. <laughs> yeah. Man cave. Well, Blue, any time, any time you want to go live, just, just give me a chat. Okay, great. So just send me a message and I'll I'll hop in. I'll do that. Because I, I'm working from home now, so I can do that. Okay, cool. Hey. Yeah, I think I'm gonna start doing some more live stream stuff. Oh, you definitely should. I missed that voice. I, really yeah, I think do. it'll be fun. Cavendish was uh surprising to me how many people would sit and watch that silly thing. For well, hours. I mean, I mean yeah, that, yeah, that, hours. that's why I asked yeah, that's why I started shouting out the the change in time because it'd be like 20 30 people just sitting watching it for four hours yeah, yeah. Like, what you, i mean it's well, great giving you the view and all that but come on say something you know Par partly partly it is a chance to just chill with blue i yeah. think so i think so that's why i tune in most of the time when i was tuning in though i was um i was working so i had my headphones in and i was just lurking couldn't say anything because i was actually on the line and lurking yeah. Well, those were those were good streams, and uh, in the sense, is it, is it I mean, weird? Is it, there, it wasn't do people a lot of arguments and stuff? Do people still ask you about it all the time? Yeah, 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 they do. You're that guy now. You're that guy. <laughs> You're the Cavendish guy. Was it hard to be equipment? Right yeah, what was that, Patty? I said, I'm, I'm, uh, uh, oh. What was that, Patty? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I I heard what you said. I fucking heard okay, what you I'm, said. I'm gonna fucking Why type. Why are you asking then? To wind them up, and it's fun. Um, <laughs> but what channels do you be around? Because are you still around um, the Aussie Perspective? Because they don't. I, I haven't seen much from the Aussie Perspective lately. Uh, you, you're talking about uh, Terry Davies. Mm -hmm. yeah yeah i uh i try to make uh, terry's show 
twice a week. Although yeah. he didn't do it on Wednesday this week for some reason. Yeah, I but haven't been getting. Do. I haven't been be getting the. Um, no, I haven't been getting. Oh, tomorrow morning. Ooh, I might tune into that. Well, it's people up. probably this morning for you almost. Yeah. Yeah, it's um. Twenty to twelve. Because you know daylight saving shit. Yeah, he should be um, on in about twelve hours, more or less. Uh, well, eleven hours, I think. Ten o'clock, so he's going back to ten. Okay. Yeah, he's he's usually on uh, at, at around six a.m. Uh, my time, Eastern Standard Time. What makes you get up at six a.m. to be on Terry Davies' oh. stream? <laughs> oh, um, six a.m. Full stop. Six doesn't have an a.m. <clears throat> That's an indication of how exactly how damn bored you get when you retire. Aww. Oh, that's not good, man. I've always got. I always get up early anyway, though. Uh, I'm usually uh, wide awake by uh, uh, four thirty or five o'clock in the morning. So, see, so that, that gives me ideas. You see, that gives me ideas. Yeah, I was fun. about to agree until yeah. I said morning. Like well, four or you five see, six. That's reasonable. Six no. six a.m. six a.m. for him is like ten eleven o'clock for us, right? Which is reasonable. It's reasonable. Mm. Yeah. Mm. And since I work from home now, you know, we could have some, We could have a bit of fun. Definitely have a bit of fun. Well, you could be in trouble, mate. <laughs> I want you right now. You could be in trouble. Nah, just chilling on a live stream is good fun. But uh, I'll definitely, I'll, 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 I have to go back and see about Terry because I don't know if it's, I, I, I'm pretty sure I'm still subscribed to him, but it's not been giving me updates at all because YouTube sucks. What other shows? Are, are you still around Jose's? I thought yeah, I drop in Jose's from time to time. Probably more often than not, really. Why? He usually does it Why? Pretty good time for me. So, is that is that again um, a relief from boredom? Yeah, I, I, I still don't understand. I go on I there. I don't. I usually don't say very much. I went on Jose's today, just watching for the first time in months. It was pretty chill, and then someone came in called Flat, flat Bro Earth Data, Data or something. Yeah, no, it wasn't Flat Earth Data. It was some Bro something. Yeah, more like Flat uh, Earth dipshit. Yeah, and it just yeah. turned into yet yeah, another shouting match, and he kept saying a particular word, and Jose said, "Don't say that word again, or I'll kick you off." And then he said it again and again and again and again, and it was like, Do you know what? I'm Jose done. won't kick anyone oh. off. No, he has in the past, but it was just um, the guy was just there to just to trigger people and just act like an ass. And it's like this hasn't this show hasn't changed in five years. It's just the same thing over and over again. It's amazing that the the people on shows like that, and not, not just Jose's, but other um, panel shows like that, still have the energy to keep going. Like I I, I look into uh, Gem Panda's server every now and then, just to see how many people are actually on it. Um, and holy shit! Yeah, people if are Discord still talking. Ever, if Discord ever needs an enema, that's where they'll put the hose. <laughs> It's an absolute <laughs> cesspit. Like, while we're talking now, there's like, you're in there, Blue. You're in there. I see you. <laughs> I see you. You're 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 deafened, but you're you're there. And they're uh, instigating. Yeah. I, over Are you? Do you fucking just chill there all day? Oh, I was uh, listening to Rumpus uh, and and Jim talking about something or the other. I had been listening to it on YouTube just to have some background noise going on. But I, I don't. Uh, but there's I don't around a lot like thirty people either. in that chat. There's a whole lot of people in there. That's amazing. Just, just that people have the energy to continue these discussions. It's great. It's great to see. It's exhausting, but it's great to see that people <laughs> still have the energy to engage in in those. Is lemon tub still around. Oh yeah. God, yeah, that's lemon. that's why I can't go on there anymore then. I just can't stand listening to that gish gallop, absolute garbage. I I mean, it's quite remember. impressive that he can keep going for five minutes at a time, but it doesn't say anything. 
Absolutely. Never says anything. I think that's part of the appeal for him, that you can word salad without actually fucking chemo is still in there as well. Yeah. Chemo's absolutely worthless. When chemo's in there, I definitely don't go in there. Yeah, he's a fucking oh, he's disgusting. He he said something to me a while ago, and I'm just I was just like, uh, no. He, he said something like, because I used to be religious, and he was like, you know, you used to be good, you used to be pure, and you. I was like, fuck <laughs> off. Who the fuck? Really? I'm like, right, you're right. Okay, fuck off. You used to be on the right path. You used to be good because you used to believe. Doesn't mean I'm any different of a person now that I don't fucking believe. And yeah, but oh, no, no, no. Jesus doesn't want you for a sunbeam. <laughs> I don't want to be a fucking sunbeam. Thank you very much. Well, that makes Jesus cry. Yes. <laughs> Objective achieved. <laughs> speaking Excellent. of, speaking of. Uh, this time next week, in and around this time next week, I will be getting ready for um, Truth Wanted. I'll be yeah. a guest appearance on Truth Wanted. So if you're not subscribed to them, go and subscribe. It might be fun. Oh. And if any of you fuckers call up and try to wind me up, I'm going to kick your ass. <laughs> the yes, number. Tusk, I'm looking at you. No, I... I... <laughs> I don't even know what the number is. Oh, one five one six three nine four. No, I, I, it's probably on too late for me. Yeah, it's on one o'clock. Yeah, it's too late for me. One a.m. for us. So it's if you guys are me. around, if you guys are around, so yeah, it, it's weird because it came out of the blue. Um, I was asked to guest appear on Truth Wanted. I have no idea how that came about, but. I'm looking forward to it. It should be fun. I'll be on with Puck. Um, it's going to be great. It's going to be great. I hope. I don't yeah. know. I'll try, try to watch that. Yeah. I kind of moved away from the kind of atheist experience and um, those debates for a while there, but I've been watching um, The Line yes. or, and The Hang Up with uh, Matt Dillahunty and whoever the... It sounds like just and whoever else, you know, just brush them off. They're not important. But it's just again, it's just the same arguments that have been brought up again and again and again. But it's gonna, it's a nice wee change from like flat earth nonsense. Just yeah. sharpen my skills. Thanks, Teddy. Presuppositional Ooh. debates. Yeah, I mean it, it's it's a growing thing again. Um, people took a step back for a while, but there's there's more, um, going on in the kind of theist communities because a lot of um. A lot of Muslims are coming around to the, the discussion, mm -hmm. which is great because we're able to have civil discussions. Uh, so, yeah, it'll be interesting. It'll be fun. Oh, you're, you haven't been announced yet on their, on their page? On your no, page. no, no, no. Oh, I'm <laughs> worst kept secret ever. But um, Well, you will run around telling everyone. <laughs> no. I asked if I was allowed to tell people and they said, yeah, sure. Because in fairness, like, I have a few subscribers compared to them. It's like, me. Eh. Compared to the ACA as a whole, I have, like, what, 2,000 subscribers, which are amazing. Um, so, yeah. Happiness. I haven't, I haven't hit it because oh, I did ask and they said I was allowed to tell people, so. And the fact that it's only next week now, and I'm excited. Um, so what I'm going to do next week, because I'm a total bitch, uh, <laughs> is about an hour or so before I go into the phone call, uh, I'm going to have a members-only stream. Um, and we're going to have a chat, because I haven't done that in a while. So members, if you're around next Friday, uh, before I go in for... Truth wanted, we'll have a little chat. So watch out for that because I, I'll probably be announcing it a couple of hours beforehand, like I did this. Because I don't tech. <laughs> Say nothing. Say nothing. No, you cannot. No, you cannot. Did you, yeah, perfect, nerdy. Perfect. That's exactly what they're on about. No, no. 
but yeah it should be fun it should be fun <laughs> yeah that's that's what the show's about it's the truth about dragons wanted that's his full title sure <laughs> anyway moving yeah, swiftly really on get. moving swiftly on well you see mm. i don't have a problem with dragons i'm allowed a dragon you're not any we'll members, see, in, the see chat, any members in the chat get the no dragons for tusk in the chat please it's not funny oh it, it's it, it is fucking well, hysterical some, some things have to be done yeah <sighs> Times like that, you really will find out who your friends are. Yeah. <laughs> Aren't I such a good one? Yeah. Yeah. yeah exactly. I, <laughs> I, I know. I'm, I'm but, the best. I'm so, the best. So, Crafty, when can we expect in your new uh, Challenging Conspiracies video to come out? Yeah. Um, that's coming out hopefully Wednesday or Thursday. Oh, oh, oh so, so we, are still, we are still keeping to our promise then from last week to have it out within a yeah. couple of weeks. Yeah, it's, it's coming out this week. Yeah. Um, and how about the mythical creatures? Mythical creatures, and I'm not telling you anything else. Oh. You're gonna have to watch it. Nice I was gonna watch nice it time. anyway. I know. I thought, well, you've got on, you know, maybe an unguarded moment. <laughs> Me unguarded with you two around? Not a hope. Mm, fair enough. <laughs> don't, you did, don't you didn't have a big axe. <laughs> <laughs> it was a big axe. That was, it was a very big axe. That was, that was funny. Um. <laughs> really really johnny <laughs> that's not cool that's not cool i think um blue has run back in to talk to have you become undeafened oh I'm... what are they saying what are they saying i'm good oh, okay i want to know so... what they're saying now so look look you have <laughs> me interested you have me curious i can't read what johnny's written there what can you read that for me killer if you can't I've read my... english then I've... You're i can't read english yeah. Would you? Would you? Oh, would you mind? Okay. No. I can't. I can't see that comment. Would you mind reading it out, please, Crafty? Nope. nope. I would mind, and no. But anyway, Blue, what have you got coming up? Have you got anything coming up for us? More live streams. More live streams. Mm, yeah. 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 Well, and, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm going to work on that. I really am. We were, we were talking like a year ago. <laughs> yeah, I know. We were talking a year ago about something. What were we talking about? Do you remember? It was, yeah, same thing. Yeah, but what did we want you to do? Oh, I forgot now. Yeah. See, I haven't. Uh, we, we want story time with Big Blue. Oh, story. Oh, time. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. We need a story time. I so if there's. That. Yeah, if there's any authors who want to write some uh, flurfy shit for him to read out, <laughs> <laughs> or flurf busting shit, I don't know. What is this going something to fun? Something blue marble fun. fan fiction. Well, yeah, that could be arranged. Well, you could do that. That would be fun. Yeah, that'd be fun. Absolutely. Funny, actually. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, we could get you to do some uh, fun stories. <coughs> I have some ideas. I just need time to actually put them on paper and then send them to you. But you're still interested, yeah? You're yeah. Yeah, absolutely. Yes. Well, now that we got Cavendish pretty much behind us, I still want to do a few videos. Uh, yeah, no, understandable. I need to do the, do, I got to do the outro for, for Cavendish and then officially go through. Uh, oh, apparently you've triggered, were, you, you've, you've like triggered Rachie. You've triggered Rachie. Oh, yeah. Rachie's not happy with me. Oh, no. Ra Rachie is a flat earther. She's not happy in general. Yeah, with anything. <laughs> Especially herself. Poor Rachie. Uh, yeah. She's a gobshite. Poor Rachie. Yeah, she's, I don't know. She's a, she's a good flurf, I think. She is now. <laughs> um. Yeah. Yeah. Her and Riley. Hmm. Oh, well, that's, that's a real problem. She's uh, Riley got his hooks into her. And, yeah. And now all she's doing is just parroting the bullshit that comes out of Anthony. Uh, oh, she, and apparently, she, apparently, um, Ruhif, Ruhif is a flurf, or pretending uh, to be a flurf, pretending to be a flurf, 
and oh, yeah. paying all the flurf channels to see which one will come over to the globe side and apparently ranty took the bait what? yeah that that oh. didn't make any sense at all what he said he's pretending to be somebody else i can't remember call him simon who's been going on to flat air <laughs> channels and giving them money 500 at a time 500 at a time as a flat earther paying for you know oakley's stereo system and so on but then it he asked Oakley to kick somebody off the channel. Oakley said no. And that somehow makes some Ruhif in disguise. Yeah. It's bizarre. Although I've just had a, an offer on um, Facebook Marketplace for something that I'm selling. And it's an offer of a trade. And it's a copy of the 14 Times, a Colgate Omron toothbrush head for an electric toothbrush, and Darren Brown's autobiography. Fuck's sake. <laughs> Genuinely an absolute pile well, of shit. That is uh, e eclectic, we'll go away. Yeah. It's not even a new copy the 14 times, it's June 20. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Is the it's toothbrush in... used? No. It's... <laughs> it just says, it says Colgate Omron <laughs> Clinical Refill cleans oh, in three ways. But I, I, I don't want an electric toothbrush. I don't even have electric teeth. <laughs> but, but it's just such a, a niche and bizarre thing to offer somebody in, oh, in God, trade. Sorry. Fucking hell. Okay, that was just strange. I thought I'd just thought I'd share that. Cheers. Cheers for that thought, little uh, side well, rant. Yeah. Well, earlier on, somebody sent me a message demanding their money back for a flask I'd sold them because they said it poured out from the wrong side. I said, well, take the fucking lid off and put it on the right way around then. <laughs> 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 We have a Gary. We have a Gary. Oh, God, no. We have a Gary. Hi, Gary. <laughs> Good to see you. How are it you? Really isn't. It's been a while, Gary. What's the story, man? I'm using Streamlabs today or StreamYard today. So, uh, you know, your, um, your bipolar phone won't come on. I'm allowed to make that joke because I am bipolar. But your bipolar phone won't, won't allow you on. It'll allow you onto fucking meets, but apparently not StreamYard. So, anyway. What a shame. I know. I'm absolutely gutted. Oh, no. We can't have Gary, the despicable liar, on. What a shame. <laughs> Yuri doesn't like me. Doesn't oh. Like me, oh, Gary, are you serious? Are you serious? Because I can give you the stream and... Uh, the StreamYard key right now. You you can come on for the whole like three minutes that we're going to continue. I tell you what, I tell you what, all right? Message me on Sunday. Um, message me on Sunday, and if you're around, we might get you in. Um, Gary, hmm. do me a favor though. Unblock Bo Bob Nodell's gyroscope. Bob really wants to talk to you. Come on, man. Be nice. Be nice. He'll just deny that he is blocked and say he doesn't block anybody. But he's blocked so many people now yeah. that it's not even funny. Yeah. Oh, fun. Fun times. See, we get all sorts in here. I like Gary coming in. See, Gary knows. Gary knows that if he talks to people in a proper um, conversation, he won't get timed out. Whereas if he uses the copy and paste that he did in Sean's the other day, he'll just get timed out all the time. Yeah, I actually had fun today doing that because it's been a while since I've just like bubble wrapped them and just pop, 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 pop. It's quite therapeutic. Every time you copy and paste or you put words into somebody's mouth or attack like blue when they're not there to defend themselves, you get timed out. You've been warned over and over again and you still do it and it's the same copy and paste shit you've been doing for two or three years. Fuck it, you're nearly 50, man. Grow up. Attacking Blue in any way, shape or form is not cool. No, but it's the, oh, Blue and Bob the Science guy said this about Coriolis. No, they didn't. Oh, no, yeah, didn't. yeah, 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 yeah. Mm. I, I remember I mean, that. Using that same copy and pasta... For at least 18 months. 
yep. and that's not what he said. And he's told you to your face that's not what he said, <laughs> and you still insist that he did. So it's just it's tedious. He'll pick one sentence out of an hour long con- conversation. Yeah, totally, to- yeah. totally, totally out of context, yeah, completely so. taken out of context. Yeah. If you say, well, yeah. Yeah. you say, well, QE said this, and then you quote QE, he says, oh, you said this because technically speaking, you did. Yeah, but it's completely out of context. It's not your words, but it uses that as some as proof somehow that the Earth's flat. Mm-hmm. It's so stupid. It's so dishonest. And the worst of it is, everybody knows what you're doing. Right. Well, <laughs> you know, it's... you know, I, did, I didn't until I met Gary. I didn't realize the shape of the Earth was actually up to me solely, totally. I'm the one yeah. that gets to decide. Oh, you're, you're, what, yeah, you're, you, you have so much Earth power. Is. You, you, you have, have so the much power. power. You are the sole arbiter of the shape yeah. of the earth. What you yeah. say goes. Yeah. And if and if Gary can quote you out of context, then that's proof positive that the earth flat and we're all wrong. Oh, Not the, only wrong, but stupid. The, the you know the, the the responsibility is absolutely frightening. I don't know how you cope, frankly. Uh, I, I guess that's why that's, you. That's why I don't sleep. sleep. That's why I don't, <laughs> I don't sleep. sleep. But yeah, that's why you use, like, three yeah. o'clock in the morning. I have to yeah. spend all I have to spend all night every night worrying worrying about what shape I want the fucking earth to be tomorrow. <laughs> well, can you keep it um a globe for now? Because I have a holiday to Australia planned. <laughs> I'd, I'd quite like to go not have to go north for that <laughs> from the UK. <laughs> and, and so according to the flat day. earth map. Mm. One day okay. Okay, globe it, globe it is. Globe it is. Thanks. Just, just just keep we, it as a globe. We do though. appreciate that. Like, oh, I, I, I know that that's a hefty responsibility that you have. <laughs> yeah, it's like you're the globe earth Santa, and we all really appreciate that. <laughs> <laughs> um, right, so if we're getting uh, Blue Marvel Science to read off stories out for us, uh, can I submit some? No, no, no erotic scenes. No, 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 no. No, no, for two reasons. No, just no, and really don't want to know what you find erotic. So no, <laughs> that that terrifies me. <laughs> Johnny, you're evil. Just saying, you're evil. That, what's what's he saying now? I can't, I can't see his messages. Can you not? It's right there on the screen. Uh, I, I don't speak English. Oh well. Was <laughs> just that? Oh well, is that it? Fine, mate. You need to learn how to let shit go. You really do. And just like, what, what, what is feelings of egress? <laughs> Fuck off! <laughs> you. And with that, <laughs> Blue, thank you so much for coming on. Hi, thanks for inviting me. It's I awesome it. to have you around. Um, yeah. I, I miss talking to you. I really do. I really do. So if, if you are having any live streams, just chuck me a message and I'll see if I can come on. I'll do that. I'll do that. I'm going to spend a little more time on the channel now that uh, some of the confusion has gone away. Well, and it helps that I'm not working 12 hours a day anymore. Because yeah. I was for a while. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. But yeah, give a me a show. Been give a pleasure, a though. Thanks. So uh, anyone that wants to go check out Big Blue, if you haven't already subscribed, you should. Um, and go check out the Cavendish experiments. It's all there. It's all there um, on his channel. So that's awesome. Chatty! I was Amy. Thank you for coming on. Do you want to say goodnight to people? Goodnight to people. Uh, aye, yeah, Good night. Tusky bollocks. Oh, well, thanks very much. Well, I just, uh, just like to say uh, thanks, Santa. We do appreciate that. It's, it's nice to hear your voice, and especially this close to Christmas. When I know you must be busy, so that's well, that's pretty much it. Yeah, he, he's he's trying to get um, he's trying he's trying to sift through the the flirt letters and and like give them all coal. Um, <laughs> We need, we will talk in, in, in a little while about um the video. The video. Me, you and Taddy. Oh, okay. We can talk about the video. Maybe tomorrow. 
Um, you keep on saying the video in these kind of like weighty terms, and I've got no idea what you're talking the about. Video. Oh, that doesn't, that doesn't make it any clearer. <laughs> the horse video. Oh, say that then. No, because it's the video. Uh, okay. It's the only fucking video that I'm talking about. Um, or that I would be talking about. But yeah, we need to have a chat about that because Taddy's, Taddy doesn't want to give it to me. No, I'm just going to say, Taddy doesn't want to give it to me. He doesn't want it on my channel. He wants it on yours. Oh, Which is going to be anyway. Anybody can have it. That's yeah, trouble. see? See? Oh, no, See, no, Teddy? no, 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 no. <laughs> well, we'll talk about that. Oh. Good night, people. Good night, all. <laughs> Up Bye. yours, Gary. Night. See ya. Good night.